Hey, Frank. It's cracking, man. So the chemical weapon in there, right? If it even is a chemical weapon, hell, it could be shaving cream for all I know. By the way, next time you're getting wet. Oh, but there won't be a next time, will there, Davy? There never is. I'll do my best for you. I always try. Yeah, well, maybe this time we'll get lucky. Maybe this time Steve will succumb to the strains of enhanced interrogation techniques. Interrogate him? Are you insane? They're probably decorating him right now. Hey, Davey, your boys at the agency are on to you, remember? Huh? You and Stevie. Just try and keep your heads down. Yeah, putz. What is this? Oh, fucking A. Yes! What's up, man? My days in the wilderness are over. Lester, he settled up with that crazy Mexican motherfucker. Gave him the artifact. <laughs> now, as long as Trevor handles the wife, we're good. But what about him, man? Yeah, fuck him. He likes the desert. Besides, we do one big score, we're all gonna have to go our own separate ways anyway. Oh, man. I can't wait to get back to that movie studio. <laughs> Yo, all right, man. Well, shit, I'll holler at you later then, all right? What a shit show. I'll tell you what, you could take this desert and stick it. My life may be a world of pain, but from here on out, it's going to be cool, comfortable, air-conditioned pain. <laughs> take it easy. I had a wonderful time, Trevor, but we both know I made a vow to my husband. I know! You have a great pain inside you, but you are a beautiful man. I've never been so happy and so sad in my life. You have a beautiful way with words. There's no, there's no reason to ruin what I love bad as me. I am not abandoning you. I am going home. You treat you! I know. I know. No. Stay. You better treat her right, man! I will, amigo! The otherwise... The other ear! Of course! The way I see things, you and me and Michael, we're, we're friends now. Good friends! Such good friends that we will make a great effort to avoid one another. That's fucking perfect. Uh, thank Michael for this statue. It is exquisite. Yeah. Yeah, I will.
I miss you already. What the F word are you doing here? That's a funny way to greet your cousin. You ain't my G-damn cousin, Trevor. I thought we was family. But please, just go and ruin somebody else's home furnishings. Who the F is that boy? No one, my sweet. Hey, by any chance, did you catch crabs at that conference? I heard that those conferences are regular little fuck fest, huh? Guy, come in. Huh? I'd like you to leave mm. right now. Oh yeah, some serious corporate gang banging going on, right? Yeah, with every executive and director of communications from here to Bangalore taking it left, right, and center in the name of team training, right? I mean, now that's what Floyd told me yesterday as he was staring at my uh, my penis. I want you to leave. Look, this is all I've got, all right? I had a tough upbringing. My daddy was not nice to me, okay? And look, Deborah, I love you, and I love you too, Floyd. Why can't we all just be together, huh? You can have Mondays through Thursdays. You can have the weekends, all right? I know that's not normal, but in this crazy, crazy world, is normal so good, huh? Look, Deborah, Floyd, will you marry me? Get out of my condo! And you go too, Floyd! I told you, I've got a career! I don't need this, this, this crap! Yes! There. <laughs> you made me swear. You're crap, Floyd. Crap! <laughs> You're not a man at all. <laughs> Bob's right about you. Oh, who's Bob? I want both of you to go now, you and your weird friend. Whoa! Hey! My name is Trevor, sweetheart. I could give a fuck what your fucking name is! I'm not afraid to use this. I'm not. Bob taught me. Fuck Bob! You people are not very fucking nice! There, Trevor. <laughs> oh. mm, hey there, Wade. Did you meet Gebra? Interesting lady. Yeah. I should probably go say hi. I wouldn't. Why not? Let's go get in the car. All right. Let's go have the time of our lives. Oh, I know exactly where to take you. I could run in and get Floyd and Gebra. I know she seems kind of uptight, but she can have fun. Mmm, no. I don't think she can, Wade. Just Floyd, then? Floyd's gonna meet us there. Floyd's trip? Exactly. Oh, Trevor, maybe you got all over yourself. You're all red. You got, you got syrup? Yeah! Syrup. Accidents. We've all been there. We sure have, but... But it don't taste like syrup. Don't taste me, all right? Just no licking. Okay. Hey, you remember when we met? Sure. Last year. I was on the way to the gathering with Daisy Bell and Kush Chronic and... And you stopped in Sandy Shores to get lit, and you met a dealer, and he looked after you when your friends had abandoned you. That was weird, weren't it? The last time I saw him, it was with you, driving out to a quarry, and then they just... just disappeared. Poof, right? I mean, they were gone. Some friends, right? And now Cousin Deborah don't want you around? I mean, there's a pattern here. The condo did get messy. The pattern is you can't rely on anyone, anyone except me. Look, this is it. So this is where Floyd is going to meet us, a strip club? Oh, yeah. That's unlike him. He's a real homebody. He loves that apartment. Interestingly, you and me, we got a new home. Where? <laughs> Here. Mm, right here. Here? Mm, 
here. Now, I know it's unconventional, but that's the way we roll, homie. Hey, you, you two. You two, I want you to give this boy a good time for a long time. Hey, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Tell me where the manager is for this fine establishment. Through there and take two doors to the right. Mm -hmm. Through there. To the right. Thank you. Amigo! Prepare to meet your new partner. Hey, Lester. Hey, uh, Trevor just called about the, um, the big one, the, the UD. You know anything? Yeah. I told him we could hit it. You down? Of course I'm down. Look, I'll get my research together and meet you at Trevor's. He's taking over the Vanilla Unicorn Gentleman's Club. All right. Message Franklin. 